Hello everybody, my name is John Tabatabai and I am here in the beautiful Las Vegas. Of course, it is the World Series time, um, which is one of my favorite times of the year and probably the same for many thousands of people. I've been out here for around 10, 11 days. Um, I haven't been playing too much poker as, as usual, I guess. In these, it's very difficult when you're here in Vegas, there's so many distractions. But I have been good, I've only been out a couple of times. I've been working out um, regularly and I actually feel that that's helped me so much in my game this year, which helped, I, uh, wow, I can't even speak properly today. It helped with my deep run in the, um, in the 5K event, but no final table, unfortunately. I'm saving it for the main event, so no big deal. The Betfair players all came out uh, a couple of days ago and it was really, what's the best way to describe it? It was, it was like a team Betfair because there was so many people, unlike in the past when there's only been you know, five or ten people this year. I think we had like 50 or 60 players, representatives of Betfair, which is unlike any other event. You know, we had free roll qualifiers. We had like a bunch of the regs who were playing like the 5, 10, 10, 20 games. There was people, you know, from the sit and go uh, stakes. Even people who were playing the lower limits, because Betfair ran, as most of you know, so many different um, ways of qualifying this year, which was beautiful. And it was, it was actually very interesting to see you know, a lot of the people, it was their first time in Vegas. So it was quite fun, you know, watching them walk through the casino, these huge buildings, which you don't even have in the UK, with thousands of slot machines everywhere, girls barely wearing anything, sometimes guys too, which is obviously a strange sight. But no, it was, it was um, fun to see people's first time reaction for the Virgin Vegas people. And our welcome party was actually really cool. It was down at the Laguna Bar in the Palazzo where there were so many bet for people, we actually overtook the whole area. So that was quite fun. And as a treat, well, a pretend treat, I guess, um, I thought we'd give, I thought we'd give? I thought I would give um, all the players 5% in, of my winnings in yesterday's event, which was the 1K bracelet event, because I, I generally thought I was gonna go there and pick up a million dollars. Turns out it wasn't that easy. And I actually cashed for, Oh yeah, yeah, nothing. So they get zero. Fantastic. Um, I'm sure I'm going to get mauled when I go downstairs for the best for dinner in a few minutes. So if you see me next time with scratches, that's probably going to be why. Tomorrow night we've got the the real bet fair, team bet fair party over at Surrender, which is in the Wynn Hotel. For those of you who haven't been to Vegas, the Wynn is, I guess, like an eight-star hotel. It's out of this world. They spend $100,000 a day on flowers alone. I mean, can you believe that? So if, if there's a hotel that spends that much money on flowers, can you imagine what the club is like? It's, I'm not going to say too much because I think we're going to get a video of that so you guys can see it. But that's, that's going to be an incredible party. So if you're here in Las Vegas and you play on Betfair, please come on over. If you don't, then you really should be playing on Betfair. Um, and then after that, I am playing the main event on Sunday, which I, of course, uh, am going to win. And yeah, then I look forward to giving you my next blog about how I managed to win it and how I made my aces hold up against kings 34 times in a row. All right, guys, take care, all the best, and I'll see you on the tables.